Hi children, today we are going to read the book Peppa and the Coronation from Peppa Bee Collection of Books. Peppa and the Coronation It was bedtime and Peppa and George were listening to a story. And then the fairy queen cast a spell. The ice melted and everyone lived happily ever after. Read Mommy Pig. The end. Wow! When I grow up, I want to be a queen and make everyone happy, said Peppa sighing. Mommy Pig smiled as she tucked Peppa and George into the beds. What a lovely idea, Peppa, she said. You would make an excellent queen. Mommy asked Peppa, Didn't you want to be a queen when you grew up? Mommy Pig laughed. Unfortunately, that's not how it works, Peppa. To become a king or a queen, you need to be born into a royal family. Who oh, said Peppa sadly. Mommy Pig gave Peppa and George a kiss goodnight. Did you know there is going to be a coronation soon? She said. No, said Peppa. What is the coronation? A coronation is when a king or a queen is crowned, said Mommy Pig. Ooh, Peppa gasped. That's exciting. Exciting, agreed George. Isn't it, said Mommy Pig. Now sleep tight, my little ones. But Peppa couldn't sleep. She kept imagining become a queen. George, are you awake? She whispered. If I was a queen, I would have a shiny gold crown. And I would jump up and down in muddy puddles every day. The next day at playgroup, Madam Gazelle told the children that they will be having their own coronation. Whomever can tell me what a coronation is will win a special prize, says Madam Gazelle. Everyone went quiet. Nobody knew what a coronation was except Peppa. Ooh, she said, putting a hand up. Me, me, me. I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, Peppa, said Madame Gazelle, smiling. A coronation is when a new king or queen is crowned, said Peppa. That's right, Peppa, replied Madame Gazelle. Well done, you have won the special prize. You will be crowned queen of playgroup. Madame Gazelle finished. The children gasped. Ooh, Peppa grinned. Susie she frowned. Don't worry, Susie, said Madame Gazelle. After Peppa's coronation, everyone will have a turn at being king or queen. Let's get to work, said Madame Gazelle. We need to get everything ready. A coronation is a very special occasion. She pulled out paper, scissors and glue. The children began to make a crown and a throne. Cut, snip, snick. When everything was finally ready, Madame Gazelle admired the creations. Wonderful children, she exclaimed, clapping her hands. And now it's time to crown the queen of playgroup. Yeah, yeah. Madame Gazelle took a cape from the dressing up box and draped it around Peppa's shoulders. Please be seated, she instructed. Peppa sat down on her throne. Susie, said Madame Gazelle. The crown, please. Susie passed the shiny gold crown. And Madame Gazelle placed it carefully on Peppa's head. Petro Pony played a fan fan on his recorder. Toot, 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 toot. Ahem. Thank you, Petro, said Madame Gazelle when he had finished. Peppa, I pronounce you queen of playgroup. Yay! Everyone cheered. Thank you.
you said Peppa in her best royal voice. I promise to be a good queen. Madam Gazelle put on some music and everybody danced and enjoyed a royal feast to celebrate Peppa's coronation. Peppa thought being a queen was very well indeed. She danced so hard that her crown fell off. Susie picked it up and held it out to Peppa with a curtsy. You were crown, your majesty, she said. Peppa giggled and carried on dancing. Would you like to try it on Susie? She said. Peppa undid her cape and wrapped it around Susie's shoulder. I have got an idea. Sit on the throne, Susie, she said. Susie sat down. Ahem, said Peppa, signaling to Rebecca Rabbit to turn off the music. Click. Peppa carefully placed the crown on Susie's head. I pronounced Susie the new queen of playgroup. Pedro played another fanfare on his recorder. Toot, 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 toot. cheered. Susie did a special Yay! little royal wave from the throne. Then she did a big royal walk around the room. Yeah! Yummy! And she ate a delicious yeah! royal biscuit. Yeah. Susie, mm, your majesty, may I have a turn please? Asked Danny Dog. One by one, everybody had a turn at being a king or queen of playgroup. Even Madame Gazelle. She was so much fun. Bark, bark, toot, toot, hee, hee, hee. Slap, yum, munch, munch. You are majesty. At the end of the day, Madame Gazelle presented Peppa with her crown to take home. What a wonderful queen you have been, Peppa, she said. You have made everyone very happy. One is most pleased, said Peppa with a royal smile. At home, Peppa told Mommy and Daddy Pig all about what had happened at Playgroup. It was the best coronation day ever, said Peppa. I know you would make an excellent queen, replied Mommy Pig proudly. Ho, ho, said Daddy Pig. I wish I could have been there. I look rather good in a crown. That gave Peppa an idea. Hee hee, come on, George, she said. You can help. A while later, Peppa and George appeared carrying crowns for everyone. Ta-da! Look what we made, said Peppa, handing them out. You were right, Daddy Pig, said Mommy Pig. You do look rather good in the crown. So, we are a royal family after all, said Peppa. And now I declare that we all should have a royal jump in some muddy puddles. Muddy! Agri Josh. <laughs> Everyone Ma, loves Ma. being royal, shouted Ma. Peppa. Ma. Ma. Everyone loves being royal. Bye. Ma. What would you do if you were king or queen for the day? Yes, please keep dreaming and imagining your day. Hope you all enjoyed reading this beautiful book. See you soon on another book. Subscribe to our channel to watch more and more lovely videos of wonderful books. Bye.